Welcome ladies and gentlemen, Gorhamian here with Misfit Studios as always, and today I'm going to show you how to convert an image into an SVG file using Inkscape. Alright, so this tutorial is going to be short and sweet. Um, we're going to go ahead and, of course, open up Inkscape. Um, we got rid of our page border. If you don't know how to do that, go to File, go down to Document Properties, and then uncheck the box that says Remove Page Border or Show Page Border. All right, let's go ahead and import the image that we will be using. All right. <clears throat> if you guys want to know how to uh, create this pictograph kind of text um, image, I've got a how-to on YouTube as well. I'll put a link down in the description on where to find that video. Okay, so if you were wanting to tr convert this image into a vector image, it's going to be a little difficult to do so. We can actually go up to um, make sure that our, our image is selected. I'm going to go to Path and then Trace Bitmap. We're going to go bring up Live Preview, check Colors, uncheck Smooth, and check Remove Background. Let's go ahead and ramp this up to about, let's do 20. 20 scans. All right, let's go ahead and drag our image away. And as you can see, we can actually delete the second one. Um, and actually, this is the exact same steps tracing a bitmap as removing a background. I'll uh, also put a uh, link in the description on that video as well. Um, as you can see, though, we've actually, we can zoom in a little bit and our vectors are, um, have all been created. Okay, if we go up to here and um, edit by nodes tool, you can actually see all of the different nodes and vectors that it is created in that bitmap. So now that we've got that complete, we can actually go ahead and um, convert this to an SVG. All we need to do is make sure that our image is selected, go up to File, Save As. We're gonna go ahead and select where you want this file to be saved to. We're gonna go ahead and name this speed text like it is already. And then under the save as type is where you're going to convert this into different file types or file formats rather. Um, as you can see, there is a whole list of things that Inkscape can convert these images into. Inkscape's default is an SVG file. So we're going to go ahead and make sure that that's highlighted and then click save. And then if you want to take a look and of course here is our file location that we just saved that speed text to and it is in an SVG file. Thank you ladies and gentlemen for watching. Gorhamian here with Misfit Studios as always and we will see you guys next time.